I'm Dan Rusinowski. There's a new look in Sharks territory. The Sharks have unveiled their new primary logo. I think it's sweet. I mean, uh, looking at it a bit more, uh, it's like he's uh, he's mad, and uh, I think that's what we wanted to uh, to to be. And uh, I like the new logo. Oh, cool! It looks fiercer, it looks meaner, it looks tougher. I like it. The logos were designed by the same artist that created the Sharks' original logo, Terry Smith. Uh, you know, I, I talked with different people in the Sharks organization, um, and uh, you know, it was something they, that was being toyed with, uh, you know, a few years ago. And uh, you know, I, I always kind of said, yeah, yeah, I think I'd like to do that. So we started the process of discussing it, and, and we knew we would only go there if we saw something we really liked and thought it was a, a dramatic improvement, because we didn't want to lose the integrity of the market and didn't want to lose the, the equity that we had in that market. As an artist, uh, you know, your work is never finished. You keep working on a painting forever. And in this particular case, um, you know, looking at it, I'm always looking at even the original mark with a critical eye. And there were always some things I wanted to kind of come back and clean up a little bit. So I look at this logo as kind of uh, more of an updating, uh, going back and kind of cleaning up some lines and, uh, you know, giving it, um, you know, a little bit more, I'm going to say, you know, professional look maybe and adding a little more color to it. So I'm, I'm pretty pleased with how it came out. First impressions uh, looks pretty similar to what the old one is. Uh, I mean, the Sharks logo has been around for so long, so you couldn't change it up too much. Looks like there's a little bit more teal in there, and the shark looks a little meaner, which is always good. Pretty nice. Gives it more of an edge, and I like it. It's nice. To me, to make a, uh, a logo look awesome is it, it's got, and especially in our sport, it has to have a bit of meanness to it without being you know, too over the top, and that's that was a lot of things that we discussed in our meeting as, meetings as well as a group, uh, where we wanted the shark to have a little bit more of a bite to it, a little bit more meanness, uh, but we didn't want to uh, make it offensive either. Other new marks are also part of this great design scheme. There's the full shark's logo that shows us the entire fish. There's the full logo with the scripted San Jose Sharks. There's the fish all by itself. Another accent logo is the shoulder fin. Never wanted to, uh, to depart too far from your main main mark, so that's why the, the shark core element that goes through all of them, he looks the same. He's in many ways the same uh, shape and direction. You just see more of him in other in other marks than another. So uh, it, again, its its primary purpose is to give us some flexibility and creativity. Yeah, one of the things that, that I like to do, you know, when we can, is, is to kind of incorporate from, you know, from the city. Um, so in this particular case, what I, I wanted to do was, you know, to bring in some some kind of element. The other thing is the the, the idea of using the shield or press. Again, this this is kind of a more old school approach. Um, a lot of the the soccer teams, you know, around the world will have more of a, a crest shape that they have on their uniform. Well, Sharks fans, it won't be long until training camp. I'm Dan Rusinowski. We'll see you then.